casting dad was obviously a huge undertaking. There was a lot of pressure. Well, I felt a lot of pressure toward that role, um, and I'm sure everybody else involved in the decision did as well. Eric Roberts was really the perfect choice when his name came to the table. Um, Lisa Parison, our casting director, came up with the idea. Everybody was like, that's actually a really awesome idea. I'm Jack. Hades, I know it all. Hades is our heroine's father, and uh, he's a symbol. And he's a symbol of the fact that the life is not all black, all hideous, or all good, all, all, all saint-like, but it's gray. He brings a lot to this role. He's got to be dangerous for Bo and scary, and he is. Well, there's no one in mythology who rivals Hades. He is the baddest ass of the baddest asses. He can switch it to evil really quickly, uh, but he's also got that quality of, you know, when you first see him, he's sort of just like this handsome man who could be, uh, you know, your neighbor next door. Um, yeah, he was really a cool choice. You're hurt. I am hurting. He marked me. Bo finding the other side of her family, I think, gave her her identity, which again led to her growing into this powerful leader that we now know. It says a lot about this untapped power that Bo has, and so to, to find that out was really kind of surprising and exciting. I do not think Bo should trust her father, but I think there's a side of Bo that won't have a choice, because there's this part of Bo that's evil too. I think that was a really great decision, that we would actually get time with that. Anna is, is, my, is my new favorite leading lady. She's very, very um, generous. She's very uh, prepared, and she's kind, and she's good in the part. You know, Offset, he's a lot of fun and makes a lot of jokes and is really a pleasure to be around. But in the moments, we're performing together and he brings so much to it. And it's been a really, a really good learning experience for me working with him. I've been on movie sets now for 37 years and I've never been happier on a film set than Lost Girl.